What's up, gents? Brian Band is here, married man. I'm a day late. I will admit that, but I'm here. And I wanted to talk about the email this week because it's so basic, I think it's almost easy to dismiss it. Um, I talk a lot on The Married Man about, um, man, the warrior heart, right, that is in you, that is in me, and that that strength um, has no more worthy of a target than your family, than your marriage and that legacy. Uh, but I think an easy sort of twisting and, and sort of perversion of that strength is, oh, I'm the lone rogue. I'm the lone warrior. I'm going to go out and I don't need anybody. And that's just flat out. That's a lie. It's a trap. And you'll end up, uh, you'll end up in, a, in a place where you do need someone and you've isolated yourself from those who may be able to give you strength, encouragement, challenge you, call you out on your BS when, it, when you need it. And so what this, uh, what this week's email was about is simply acknowledging uh, our need for those in our life who are willing to call us out, right? And we've all heard the stories of, let's say, celebrities, athletes, whoever it is, who go out and they're surrounded by yes men and it leads to their downfall. And John... My, my, the fictitious name of my friend had men in his life who were close to him, who loved him enough and cared him enough to uh, cared about him enough to say, Hey man, this doesn't look right. And yet he was in a position where, um, he chose not to listen to what they were saying, not to hear what they were saying to him. And that ultimately led to a really, really painful situation for him and for his wife. So don't go it alone. You don't have to go it alone. It's not manly or noble to go it alone. Find some warriors to walk alongside you. Here's one little warrior right now. There he goes. Find some warriors to walk alongside you and give them authority. It is, it is not weak to give them authority in your life and say, all right, this is somebody who, if they call me out, I got to listen. My ears got to perk, perk up. And I got a couple of those guys. If they come to me and they say, you're screwing up, there's a really good chance I'm screwing up. So have those people in your life. Do not have the, don't have the, the pride and the ego that doesn't allow you to hear them and learn from them. Love you boys. See you soon.